Oh!
elections. We are praying that Lord, raise a leader in that nation, a leader who have wisdom like Solomon, a leader, oh God, who have courage like David, a leader who will be so humble like Moses, a leader, oh God, who will lead nation towards you. Because we know, Lord, when you are exalted, when you are honored, my Father, you bring glory and you bring victory to our people. But when people disrespect you and dishonor you, they only prepare for reproach. We pray, my Father, that you be exalted in the nation of Kenya, that Jehovah God, you may lift the nation up, that Jehovah God, you may lift our economy up, that Jehovah God, you may lift the status of our people up. You are a faithful God, and you don't forsake your own. Even when everybody is desperate, you are still God, and you are able to turn things around. We pray in the name of Jesus, turn things around in the nation of Kenya. Do a new thing, and that there, that there be healing in the nation of Kenya. Master, we want to thank you, even for this great nation, where Lord we live, this great nation where we thrive. How we pray in the name of Jesus, as new administration is coming in, and everybody is panicking, another a lot of people have got questions, Lord. You are the only one who can bring calmness. We pray that in this nation, bring calmness, oh God. Those who are full of fear for various reasons, we pray that Jehovah God speak, speak hope in their lives. Speak strength in their lives. Speak direction in their lives. Let them know it is well. Because Jesus, you are still seated on the throne. And our hope is in you. Our strength is in you. Jehovah, we stand in your promises. And you have said you shall never forsake our people who love you. Even at a time like this, Lord, there are many people from different nations of the world that are here. And they are panicking and they are worried. I pray in the name of Jesus that you bring calmness. We pray for the president to come, president-elect Donald Trump. Father, we pray even as he takes over this nation, that Lord, you guide him, that Lord, you lead him. You give him wisdom from heaven above. That Jehovah God, he won't lead this nation, my Father, according to his will, that he will follow your will and he will submit to your power. And you will live in this, this nation, oh God, according to the decrees and the will, my Father, that is of you. We thank you and we honor you. As Kenyans, Lord, we pray for ourselves that you help us to love you. Help us to commit our lives to you. Help us to live and to walk, Lord, in ways that can glorify you. Because when we lift you up, you are able to lift us up. Because your word tells us that when we seek ye first and we seek your righteousness, all the other things that we want in this life shall be added unto us. Our children will settle well. Our families will thrive well here in the United States. Jehovah God thinks that we want to see moving in our lives. We will move well because we have sought you. Help us as a community to become a people.